Good morning, day. Is it 40 or 41? 40 something. 41. 40 or 41. All right, so we um, left our motel and we came here to the post office to pick up a box that we had uh, sent forward with resupply, and that is only one of the boxes. The other one's not going to be here for a few days. So we're going to bounce the other one forward somewhere, and we need to do a little bit of resupply here in town. All righty, so they were very nice here. The went to Sacramento. It's being bounced to Mammoth. All right, so we're ready to get a hitch back, and this is kind of the road, the corner that we need to head up into those mountains right there. And these are all the other hikers also trying to get up there to get, trying to get a hitch. So I think our best bet's gonna be to ask someone. All right, here we go. You got it? Oh, my name's Rich. Rich, but thank my you. House, my house in Wrightwood was the vortex. Oh, for hikers, and yeah. And it was quite famous because people had come in for an overnighter. Uh-huh. And they would end up staying, you know, two or three zero days. Yeah. Yeah, man, the house is tremendous. <laughs> All right, we're unloading. So I'm going to take a picture. This is Get your watch on. Here we go. Getting back on trail, Onion Valley. This is the Onion Valley trailhead. It's gonna take us back up to the PCT. Seven, eight miles. Yep. <laughs> I wanted to get the sign in the video. A little over a mile up from that Onion Valley trailhead parking lot and there's a road down. Here comes. Hermes. Does that have anything to do with flammability? No. What about inflammability? <laughs> no. Um, I know. We're back there. Ooh, made it. That's nice. We get through this time. It was a little bit earlier, but then that's how they were before. The boys thought maybe they could throw a rock all the way down into this water. Not quite. <laughs> this would be an awesome tent spot. And then sit on those rocks. This would be an awesome tent spot. I was not looking forward to that, but it wasn't too bad. It was not. This is first. Oh, it's a marathon. <laughs> yep, it is. What happened to Mr. Ultralight? I mean, there's food in there. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Yes. Here we go. 227. That's the same as me. Dang. Plus the bear can. Plus, 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 plus but the bear There's Wait, a liter of water in here, too. No. <laughs> Every... Alrighty. Bear can. Is that thing full? No. 22, seven, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> 4.2. Whoa, that's 4.2 pounds. Oh, there is? Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. 28.3. <sighs> 28.3. Yeah, that's not No way. No pancake. I'm going to say, I'm going to say 38. It can't sub. No. no. <laughs> 41. Uh, <laughs> what the heck? 26. It's like, 26. Please, please, please. That's not bad. <laughs> it's like, please, it's too much. All right, we're out of here. We're going the mile point 1.2 to 1.6. Find a spot somewhere in there. <laughs> Woo! A mile didn't sound bad, or a mile and a half, but it's been up. <laughs> There's those guys making their way. We're almost there. All righty. We're a mile down from the top of Glen Pass. So in the morning, first thing in the morning, we're going to continue up this way, up and over that. But there's probably a lot of snow on the other side. So that's why we're not doing it now. All right. Drives 
cleaning out our spot here, making us a little um, boundary. Nice. So we're gonna throw our ground cloth down in cowboy tonight. Oh, we got some snow nearby. A couple of the boys went down to some water right there. And we're gonna get set up and cook some dinner. You're close to switch that water bottle. Nope. Our thing is probably good leaving normal time, six o'clock.